They're here. They're here. I heard them. I heard them. They're here. Come on. Come on. Come here. You can't see them because they're below the where the camera can see. Let me, let me point that down. Oh, there you go. Let me get them. Let me get them. Oh, go away, hobo. Oh, that's heavy. That's heavy, but that's a good thing. That's a good thing. Let's lock the door because there's a lot, of, a lot of weirdos out there. Well, you know what? Let's just. Let's just open these down here on the floor. Let me get my, my knife. Let's open them up. Alright, I know I'm acting like really, really, really super excited about these. Um, they're not really anything special. These things were less than a hundred dollars. I'm gonna link to them in the description below with our Amazon affiliate link. Um, let me see if this thing will, this thing will zoom out some. I don't, does it, does it, there we go. I don't know if that actually helped anything, but, but, um, these uh, are, there's two of them here. It's the... The Asus VE-198. Now they're, gosh, my head's all cut off and stuff. Let's, sorry, I, I just got home from work. All that knocking that I did on the, to the door, that, that was me. That wasn't actually the mailman. These things have been sitting here for a while. Um, anyway, this is the, yeah, the VE-198. It's a your standard computer monitor. It's got DVI and uh, VGA. There's no HDMI, which is fine because I don't like running my audio to my computer monitor anyway. I use external speakers or uh, good set of headphones. But let's um let's get this thing open. And uh, this is the stand, which I will not be using because in this other box I have a mount that I'm gonna put on my desk and it's gonna hold the two monitors together, which that will also, everything you're seeing here, I'll link uh, with Amazon affiliate links. So, oh, some, uh, some speaker, or an auxiliary. I won't be using it for this, but I'll get some use out of it. And of course, the power cord. Now let's, um, ah, pull this thing out of the box. Yeah, all right. We do add like the other one is of course in there. I'm only gonna pull one of them out here for the video because obviously they're the same thing. So, um, come on over now. So here's the monitor, and uh, whoop. so yeah, there's the uh, back here's the. I believe that's where I'm going to be putting the mount. At least I hope so. The thing on Amazon said this thing would mount. So it better. <laughs> um, and then, of course, that I'll be able to unscrew by taking that off. But uh, there's your your VGA and your DVI. They're standard. Um, oh, so there's the uh, speaker input, if that's your kind of thing. Sorry if this is dark. Like I said, I just got home and just whipped this together. And then, of course, the power cord. Um, you got all your buttons down here. You got a power button that looks like uh, maybe like the auto detect button. There's maybe your brightness menu. Oh, you know what? That's volume. Volume up, volume down. I don't have any idea what couple of these are. 
Um, so, here we go. Documentation and some more cables. So let me go ahead and put this back down. Uh, oh, so it came with a DVI and VGA cable, which is nice. I'm pretty sure I already have those laying around, but it's good to know that they're here if I need them. So, um, this is the documentation. I do want to real quick look up, if I can find them quickly, the, um, the specifications. They're 19 inch monitors, uh, but I want to be able to tell you what the max resolution is. I'm pretty sure it's that, uh, this just looks like warranty info and yeah, that doesn't actually tell me what I was looking for. Does it say somewhere on here on the box? Maybe it says here. No. Alright, well anyway, that'll all be on the Amazon description, obviously. I'm fairly certain it's the, what is it, 1440 by something? You computer nerds will know what I'm talking about. It's pretty pretty typical. Um, and I'll go ahead and open up the other Amazon box so you guys can see the mount that I got. So this is um, Wally. I guess that's how you pronounce it. Maybe it's Walleye. It's either pronounced like the Pixar movie or like the fish. I'm not sure which. Uh, but as you can see, the picture here, I'm not going to take it out right here because there's probably a lot of pieces and I don't want them getting lost instead. Later I'll just cut to what it looks like when this is all done. But as you can see on the picture here, uh, it actually just mount the clamps to the back of the desk. So you don't have like a stand or anything. And what I really like about this is that it's going to free up desk space. So and all this stuff's going to be off the desk. It's just going to take up that little bit of space, uh, which my wife really appreciates. And then, um, you know, that right there will raise and lower it. You've got a joint there, a joint there, and then, of course, these swivel as well. I'm pretty sure the only thing you're not going to, unless it does, I'm not sure, but I'm, I don't think you can angle this up and down. I'm pretty sure you just left and right swivel. So, um, yeah, I'm going to put it together. I'm probably not going to film that because uh, I'm just doing this real quick and dirty, but I'll put it together. And uh, you should have seen at the beginning of the video what my desk looks like currently. Um, and when I get done with it, I'll shoot what it looks like when I'm done. See you in a minute. All right, so this is it. Uh, the two monitors are up. You can see it's it's up on the stand. The stand is clamped back here. And now uh, my computer desk is, for the most part, free of any clutter. I'm going to tilt that down there. You still got my speakers here, my Xbox 360 controller. Back there is my modem and my router. But other than that, the, the desk is, is clear because my mouse and keyboard are down on this thing down here. And that's actually the volume control for the speakers. So uh, I really like it. It was very, very, very easy to assemble. Uh, I do want to make note of a couple of things. The monitors actually go on here real easy. All I got to do is pick it up and the monitor comes right off. So that's, uh, that's real simple. There's no screws or anything like that. It just sets on there and gravity does all the work. The, the arms are kind of stiff. But it did come with some Allen wrenches, you know, for assembling the thing. But the Allen wrenches can also be used to loosen up the joints and things like that. I did notice that the they do swivel up and down as well as left and right. So that is an option. That was something I said earlier that I wasn't 100% certain uh, would happen. And yeah, I, I hooked it up. I, I had to go in and, and do some things to my graphics card because the monitor that was hooked up to it before was a television so the graphics card was sending this awful awful picture 
to the monitors and in fact it didn't even recognize that this one was hooked up at all so I went in and I told it to auto detect everything the Radeon graphics card that I have in there it, as soon as I hit hit that this monitor lit up it changed the color settings and everything it, it looks really crisp um, and all that stuff I oh yeah and another thing about the stand the so I don't have one of those little holes in the back of the desk where um, you can feed your cables and stuff down but there are two different clamps so the clamp I used was for a, a desk that doesn't have the holes there is one that accommodates for that and you can actually stick it in the hole and I'm pretty sure that it leaves room for you to continue sticking uh, your cords down through it so that was really neat um, and it came with let me let me pull the instructions up here uh, it came with a, a third kind of mount which oh okay the the third set of instructions are for if you want to drill your own hole uh, for the cables but that's uh that's completely unnecessary so it was it was really it's I say unnecessary it's not something that I want to do it was really easy to put together the monitors look really nice like I said they're not 4k or anything but they are that that 1440 by something I probably should have looked it up but if you're into PC stuff you're, you're familiar with it uh, again, DVI and VGA only. There's no HDMI, so uh, one thing I am going to have to figure out is when I stream a console and I want to have an output from my Aver Media card, you know, so that I can see a direct feed, I'm going to have to figure something out for that. Uh, and honestly, if, if I'm going to be in this room for a while, and it looks like I am, uh, I might actually just mount a television up onto that wall right there and do that um so yeah that's that um everything that you see here there's going to be crossforge gaming amazon affiliate links for down in the description below if you if you want to buy any of this stuff or or something else please use our affiliate link uh, the way affiliate links work is even if you um don't buy the thing you clicked on as long as you make a purchase within a certain amount of time uh, we will get credit for that, and that goes a long way to uh, helping us do stuff around here. So, thanks for watching. Check out Patty Plays Pathetically. Check out our Patreon. Check out the Facebook page. Check out all the good stuff. Again, all that stuff will be in the description below. Uh, this was this was a lot of fun. I'm really excited. I'm really excited to use this. The next time I do Patty Plays Pathetically, uh, I'm going to have this, and it, it, it's going to be good. I'm... I'm stoked. Alright, have a good one. Love you guys. See you in the next video.